stupid beaver? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have me, sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. What's going on, guys? It's me, Ruggy X. Coming at you today on some more Ark Survival Evolved, and oh, oh geez, I guess I forgot to put this away. Sorry, maybe just let me go to the next slot. That metal pick there. Oh, oh, geez, I'm usually not one to show off, but here I am, pulled out this metal hatchet too. Maybe I'll just switch. The oh my God, it's a metal pike. Where does all this <laughs> that that pose though? <laughs> Where does all this metal stuff keep? Just switch onto the sword. Oh my God. So as you can tell. Oh, got my metal stuff up and going. Been harvesting that metal from our, um, well, what do I even call that? Our forge area over, <laughs> over, way over my shoulder there where that tallest tree is. I've been putting the Anki to work. So I got that stuff done. At least I feel a little accomplished because I've got metal tools. So that makes me feel a little bit safer too. Uh, and it gets me, it gets me a good start. But I'm standing here on the slab that will eventually be my base. Uh, and, uh, it's been a grind just to even fill this in with <laughs> just because of the wood. So I think like I was saying last time, but didn't do, I think I'm going to go get a beaver because I put into work and we got our hundred metal ingot over here. Let's see in our Smithy, I th should have everything. I went over and actually killed some beavers cause they were all low level, um, to try and get some higher ones to spawn. So I think that I should have. Cash words. Yep. Everything I need to craft a beaver saddle. So while I'm making this up, let me just say if you end up liking this episode to hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to see more Ark Survival Evolved videos like this one. Because uh, we have a whole lot in store. It's going to be a fun season. So I got that made. Hopefully there's some high level beavers that have spawned now. Uh, let me show you guys the final slab. I think you kind of saw it last time. But I, <laughs> I filled it in. I don't know. I may end up making it a little deeper. I'm not sure if I like these dimensions or not, but I'm going to play around with it. But the biggest thing has just been wood. Like, there's a little patch of trees over here. And there's a li little bigger patch of trees over here. But a beaver would really help because it reduces the weight that... What'd you say to me, man? Oh, no. I think I'm going to let you off like that. Because the beaver reduces, <laughs> reduces the weight of the wood. And that would help me get along, uh, get around with a lot more wood. Oh man, this is just not sounding right. Help me get around with a lot of wood um, with very little encumbrance. So that's what we're going to shoot for. We're going to see if we can't find a high level beaver. I'm going to see if I can get a hold of T-Bunny and see if I can get her to help. And uh, then the trick will be getting it home safely. I don't have an RG yet. I've kind of been a little bit uh, holding off on getting an RG at this point. I don't know why. I just hadn't felt like getting an RG. <laughs> so I'll have to ride him back home. But that's all right. No biggie. Let me get old T-Bunny. And then uh, we'll cut in when we find something good. All right. So we found a level uh, 92 beaver. Mine. Uh, oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> but you are going to help me carry it on that thing, right? If it's mine. Oh. Yeah, you can look at it. Every okay. once in a while. Okay. okay. Yeah, I'll let you. That's cool. I'll let you pet my beaver. Oh, anyway, yeah. so. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so I wanted to kind of, I was thinking about taming it down here, but now I'm thinking that's a poor idea. Uh, mm -hmm. So I think, but I want to give him a fighting chance. You know, we got to make it entertaining. I'm not just going to drop him in a taming pen. So maybe once he comes out, uh, T-Bunny, you can grab him with your RG. Where is I he? think it's this one by the most giantest salmon I've ever seen in the entire history of my oh life. Oh, my Lord. You see how huge that thing is? Uh, what? You see him? Yes. Yeah, looks see. like there's a daggum dolphin in a river. All right, let's see. 52. Uh, yeah, it's that one that just came out. Put one. And then started swimming by the yeah. big old salmon. Yeah. Snatch him up, T-Bunny. Snatch him up, T-Bunny. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> you missed your opportunity. Now we'll never get him. There was another one. Yeah, I think the other one's like a level 60 something. And yeah. that's the one I originally thought. And then, but it was all foggy. There you go. You got, got him. him. Now, with your bird having about negative 20 movement speed, <laughs> we'll take him back to, oh, okay. We'll take him back to my base and I'll tame him up in there. Okay. Yeah, there's a Therizinosaur over here too. Yeah, there's all kinds of bad stuff. Therizinosaur. <laughs> I saw Baryonyx. There's, there's 
terror birds. I just I don't want to I don't want to risk it. We'll just take him back to my place. Okay. All right, we're back at base, and now we get to see what this thing's made of. Does he have what it takes to take on the great Rocky, master of metal tool making, but user of primitive bow? I don't know. We're going to have to see. You see, oh. that? you see that right on that rock? Yeah, I see it. I knew that you had Man. planned on doing that. That's yep. why I had my sights already lined up. Yep. I thought he was about to take off off the cliff. That is a legitimate concern, actually. I'll pick him up. <laughs> okay, yeah, I appreciate it. I burned so fast, you know. Are you not entertained? Mm -hmm. <sighs> it's kind of speedier than I thought. He probably has a movement speed uh, boost. <laughs> yeah, if we're lucky. I'm definitely going to have to look and see what he's got his points pumped into. Oh god, he's he's gaining it on me. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, little beaver. He's got so many arrows in him. <laughs> Aha! Agility. Oh! Oh god! Oh god! One oh, hit took, oh, no, took almost a quarter of my health. What? Yeah. Those things are powerful, man. They're ridiculous. You missed. Or did you? I never miss. You missed. I missed oh. that one I'm right after I said I never missed. One of us pooped! He's running! Where you going, beaver? Huh? You scared? Huh? You angry? Because your mom had a flat tail and she was all furry? Stupid looking teeth. Don't you go off that cliff, bro. Um, T Bunny? <laughs> Thank you. You're not gonna run from me. Oh god, why'd you drop him right on top of me? I feel like you may have done that on purpose. No, you didn't go out right there. Ah! <laughs> <What are you laughs> okay. Well hopefully I can access him. Okay, I can. Oh my god. He's gonna tame what? up, fall off the cliff. And then get eaten by that Therizinus Don't there. you don't you even <laughs> play right now. Okay. What are the odds of him going down right there? <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and put some berries on him. I need to go get some mijos, uh, which I've got the trike over there. And uh, <laughs> what this is this? Is just he's a magician. Yeah. Oh. He's a wizard. We Warlock. Need to, we need to call him Copperfield. Um. Copperfield the Beaver. I don't know what that is, but yes. My beard disappeared and grew back. Look at this. <laughs> Eh, you stupid beaver. He's got the strongest tail I've ever seen in the entire history of my life. <laughs> oh, God. He was like in midair falling when I tamed him. Or I knocked him unconscious. Whatever it is. All right, let's go get some mijos, and we'll be back when this thing tames up. Good googly. This is going to be a while. Okay, we got the mijos thrown on the beaver. Mr. Copperfield, hopefully. I don't know if he's a male or female. Actually, I have not checked. It's a male. I don't care, honestly, if it's a boy or a girl, just as long as it's healthy. You know what I'm saying? It's got five toes, five fingers, five claws. He doesn't. And one long yeah. flat tail yeah. capable of balance get over cliffs. Then I'm happy. So I plugged it into the Dodo Dex, and it looks like I have one of those highly revered oxygen food boost beavers. <laughs> so congrats to me. <laughs> bonus points in oxygen, bonus points in food. I mean, what more could you want I know. in a beaver? It's like a dream come true. Like my entire art career has come down to this. Uh, I guess he's about to stand up. Is he? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but he does need some narcotics. Need some narcotics? I'll pump a little. Let me pump a few. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That'll work for now. Um, but he did get, I guess, the same that's an oxygen. He got points into melee damage. So, I guess you know he's could be worse. Not much worse, but he could be worse. But it'll be a high level beaver. He'll tame out at uh, I don't know somewhere around one thirty five ish. So that won't be too terrible. We'll have a high level one anyways. And he's really just for offsetting the weight of, of the wood. And I'll just pump nothing but weight in him. So once he tames up, we'll be back. Bum, ba, da, da. I'm surprised he didn't fall off the cliff. As soon as you move and he goes to turn around, he will. No, he won't. Watch this. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Can I access him? <laughs> I was gonna ride him off the cliff, but I feel like we'd both end up dead. That's probably just pretty poor. Yeah, come on up. 
Come on, come over here. No, get on him. Uh, oh, you meant me. Good. You were there to. <laughs> good. You were there to save him. Got him. Let's take a look at him. What do you? What'd you end up with, stats wise? I got to change your name because we already decided we were gonna call you Copperfield. Copperfield. Bum 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 bum. Okay. What is that? What is that tune from? I have no clue. Is that X Files or something? I don't know. Anyways, okay, Copperfield. Twenty four thirty health. That's not terrible. Five forty stamina. I don't know if that's terrible. Uh, 414 weight. By the time we, you know, you negate it all down, that's not going to be too bad. And 206% melee. Let's see about them woods. Let's see about them woods, boy. What can you get me? Urgh! A bunch of berries. Where are the wood at? It was in there somewhere. I think it was close to 300. Am I in K-mode? Is that what's happening right now? No, now I'm in K-mode. Why can't I turn? What? What's, what's going on right now? Oh, I bet I got my... Do I have a weapon out? What's happening right now? I'm so scared. Okay, now I can turn. That was really weird. Boom. How much wood did you just get? 280. Boom. Give me some more wood. Boom. Okay. You love the tree. I wish that you could turn the whole berry getting thing off. But yeah, so he's got two, four, six, seven, eight, nine. He's got almost a thousand wood on him right now. That's what's up. And he's only half encumbered. So that'll work. I wish I could. Maybe Check there's some kind the of berries. fancy new um, berry enabling thing. Nope. What'd you That'd say? Nice. Take do what? You take off all the berries so wait, I have even more room. Yeah, that's probably what I'll end up doing. But okay, so my plan is now, so that I can get a little work done on the base, is I'm gonna start a little conga line. Come here, Dodic. Let's start a little conga line. You put the line in the coconut. I think that's. I don't remember any conga songs. Obviously. <laughs> All right. So you are gonna follow him, and then we're gonna go around. And as I get stone and wood. I can keep it on the beaver because it's going to be a whole lot lighter and I'll be able to have a ton of stuff on them and then I'll craft up on my walls and, and what's the nuts and then once I get a bunch of supplies, then I'll cut back in and we can work a little bit on this base because I'm excited to get something done on it. All right, so this conga line has been working perfectly, getting tons of material. I just have these two following each other so it doesn't matter which one I get on. Uh, and I can I can gather a ton of materials real fast. So what I want to do, as far as the base goes, obviously this is the foundation, but it's all going to sit up a whole lot higher. What I want to do is figure out how to build a fancy pants little staircase thing here. Um, so let me see. I think I want to come out two. And oh, this might be okay if I just do it like this. All right, so I'm going to place a ramp here. Then... Oh, I didn't make any ceilings, did I? That's no problem. I got my conga line. All right. Then I want to put some... What did I just hit? I hit a button. Some walls. Like so. Let me get a ceiling. Let me craft a ceiling real quick. Um, Need a little stone for my jewel. Need a little wood for my jewel. Let's look for a ceiling. And let's just craft one for now. All right. Throw this on ye old hot bar. I have no clue how this is going to look, by the way. Okay, so you go there. Let's put this. Oh, that's not going to work. <laughs> oh, okay. This whole thing's going to have to come out. Ah, oh, boy. <laughs> it's just going to have to come out more. That's not good. That's not how I wanted. That's not how I planned this at all. Not even a little bit. All right. So, hmm. Let's do this. And let's demolish this. Let's place this. Let's do this. Now we're getting somewhere. Okay. So fancy pants walk up here, fancy pants walk up here, then I need more fancy pantsins, 
Oh, uh, there's going to be so much fancy pants going on right now. Let's see. Did I even put this in the right place? Yes, I did. Okay. Everybody, everybody calm down. Everything's all right. I want that. And I want that. And I want... Um, <laughs> this. And this. And this. And this. And this. And this. And craft some more walls. I don't know if this is going to look anything like I have it envisioned in my mind. Oh, I need more. I need more. Let's see. That staircase is going to be pretty dadgum tall. But it's going to look epic. Trust me. In my mind, I have this awesome thing planned out. Let me craft some more stuff uh, and see if I can finish this side. Need some wood. Got to get some wood. Okay. Ceiling that let's make four just because we can I'm stuck can't move need some more wood he said uh no there's tons on him I just had oh. to get some on me all right ceiling now I need to finish with that I need to put a ceiling there that okay I think that's gonna be about where my my house starts that tall oh man yep it's gonna be majestical it's gonna be something it's, it's either gonna look amazing or really really bad all right so I need to do the same thing on the other side then all right so get this crap out of the way I need to go here. Mm -hmm. What's this come out? Three? Mm -hmm. All right. And then two out this way. And two this way. Mm -hmm. All right. Now I build my wallsies right uh, here, I believe. Yep. Build that. Build that. Let's throw the ceiling on first. And that. Oop. You have to put a wall there if you don't want to. Put a wall where? You don't have to put a wall there if you don't want to. I put a wall where I want to put okay. a wall. You don't tell me where to put my own walls. You know what I'm saying? Okay. No one's going to tell me where my walls belong. There's that ceiling. I'm going to need some more walls. Mm -hmm. Okay. This ramp here. I'm going to need another ramp. And we need the walls. The walls here. And here. And here. And here. And here. And of course we need it here. And we're gonna yeah, need it would have been funny if you had put that up whenever I was jumping. I and wish I up. had. Okay. <laughs> I should have counted beforehand because I need ceilings. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. I don't care do if it looks you? like I do or I don't. Alright, so I need one more ceiling. Three more ceilings. I need three more ceilings, like I said. And <laughs> uh what else did I need? I needed something. A ramp. A ramp. Rompe. And railings. Give me your rompe. Craft. Can I move? All right. Ramp here. Stone ceiling here. Here. And of course there. Yay. All right. So I'm going to fill in this whole area down here. But I'm going to have to make some modifications. Because in my mind, this part over here sticks out farther. These, uh, these little sticky outy things stick out farther than the staircase. Didn't realize this was going to be a thing like that. Hmm. Okay, give me a second to figure out what the heck I'm going to do. And we'll be up here. Alright, so I decided I'm going to bring these little uh, extensions out to make them even with the staircase. Which I actually think looks a little better anyways. Uh, just makes the place a little bit bigger. And then, since I'm using S+, let's see. 
what I'm going to do is fill in these little holes here. Can I do this here? Will you snap there for me? You'd be a good feller. Was that snapped? It is snapped. Uh, is it snapped? I don't know. That's what I was asking. Is it, it's not snapped the right way. I can tell I you that. I don't think it was snapped where you thought it was. Let me let's, snap let me on just... something else. Take care of that for me. Let, me. let me let me get up here, though. All right. So that's my bow, just in case y'all were wondering. Um, let's, let's go ahead and just put the bow up. No need for that. All right. So now this is the wrong side. See, that's what you would do if you wanted to put the wrong side down. But then we could do it like that. Oh, that looks amazing. S plus is amazing. Is this? Yep, 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 yep. Just ever so slightly. Boom. Oh, that looks good. That's what's up. Oh, that's good looking. That's look. What are you cooking? Good looking. Let's see. I still don't want to snap right. Wait. No. Huh. Um. Probably because it's snapping to the foundation below it. And you won't be able to snap it to the ramp, right? Mm -mm. So we're going to fill those in also while we're working on that. Let me throw these bad boys up here. Going to have that. I don't know what I'm going to put there yet, but I think it looks awesome. I can definitely put something there. Maybe like, oh, dude, like the Alpha Rex head. Try this one. How side. sweet would that look? Try that this would look side. amazing. Um, which number? Of course, it's not that one. It's this one. Yeah, okay, that worked. Whatever you did on that side, do on this side. I think it's because there's a foundation underneath and it's... I don't have another foundation. Oh. We'll pick that bad boy up. You okay. can't. I can't. I'm doing vanilla. You stay. I'm staying away from picking it up. Okay. But if you pick... That one. <laughs> to do what now? Game. All right. I don't have another foundation. I do. You want to snap? You want to snap? You want to snap? Boom. Boom. Now, wrong one. And, oh, it still didn't work. What's it snapping to? It's probably just because it's on the ground. Why are you no snappy? Why are you no snappy where I want you? Okay, well, hmm. We'll have to figure that out. So, this is going to end up being like just a, a porch area. Kind of thought it was going to be larger than it is, but it's not. Then, this whole area down here is basically going to be a basement. I don't know what I'm going to keep down here yet, but this will be a basement. And then the floor for my actual base will be right up there even with that. So... Let me put a couple walls down, get started on this a little bit. Oh, well, nah, we should probably do the floor first. So let's get the floor and some walls done. And then what I would like to do is through the power of time travel, cut out and then come back with a fabricator <laughs> and um, make me a compound bow. I really want a compound bow. I think what I'm missing is oil, so i got to find a way to get oil. But we'll, we'll figure all that out. Let's work on this for a little bit. All right, so we've got a little bit done on the base here. I think it's coming along pretty cool. What do you guys think? So I'm going to have that staircase. Looks pretty awesome. Here on the sides, we're going to have a door that will kind of go into the little basement area. And then obviously it all starts down here. And we can put our electrical, plumbing, whatever down here. I think it will be pretty rad. But um, I'm about built out. So like I said, I would like to get the fabricator done. Um, but let me, let me come in here. Hop on the Congo line. Work your body, work your body, come on, do it. You so slow, get out of my way, turtle, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why am I stuck in my door? Okay, I think I'm lacking oil. Let's see. Structures, metal, nope. Structures, crafting. Oh, I'm lacking a lot of stuff. <laughs> I know I can get the metal. I know I can get the spark powder. I know I can get the crystal. I just gotta get oil. Let's go. Maybe I can find some trilobites or something. All right. I'm going to go about and see if I can uh, maybe grab some stuff. Uh, maybe find some oil. Maybe swim down to an oil node. I don't know. I don't know if there's any around here. But I want to get that fabricator built. Oh. And then I guess if I get enough oil, I can make gasoline. Yeah, yeah. This is going to happen. No biggie. No biggie. We'll be right back. Okay. I really need oil. Guys. <laughs> Scale of 1 to 10. How likely am I to die on the way over to some of these oil nodes? Lock in your votes in the comments below now. I don't even know which one is closer. First side of a Megalodon, I'm taking off. But it would be pretty freaking swag if I could get down here to get this oil. 
Okay, I'm gonna hold on. Oh, dude, that's deeper than I'm thinking it is. All right, if I, if I get half, lose half my oxygen, I'm turning around and coming back. I don't care. But I just need a couple quick hits. I don't remember if I want, I think I want the pickaxe. Oh, God. Oh, this is terrifying. Blip, 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 go back up. Oh, man, 81 oil is not too bad. Nothing scary, right? Nope, everything's good. I mean, other than I'm almost drowning. That's okay. I think I'll make it to the surface. Oh, guys. Oh, God, I'm way far away. Oh, no, my stamina is a thing. Oh, I think I'll make it. I think I got oil, guys. Only needed 10, but then I needed some for gasoline, too. Oh, this is amazing. Oh. Oh, please. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so nervous. I'm just totally expecting to turn around and see a Megalodon. But I think I got this. Ain't no thing but a Pteranon Wang. Yes. But I'm going to have to find a much easier way. I know that there's those oil nodes up north. I'm trying to avoid having to go up there because one, um, I'm just in chitin armor and I don't want to freeze to death. But number two, I hate the freaking direwolves up there. They're freaking everywhere. And they will wreck your face. I have nothing to compete with them yet. So... I'd rather grab oil out of the seas, which means eventually donkey, and I'd like to get here real soon uh, a Dipocolis, because obviously you can, uh, it's a way of, I don't have a lot of polymer, but it's a way to breathe underwater on those things and get around real quick so I could get those oil nodes a whole lot better, I think. But we got what we need for now. Let's put this fabricator together. This is a real issue too. These dadgum things. There are Xenosaurs. This is the first Carno I've seen. But bad stuff is still spawning in my base. I've <laughs> Granted, it's a huge area. What are you doing, bro? Granted, it's a huge area. But I'm going to have to, I guess, place some random foundations around. I don't know if... Uh, maybe you guys will know. If uh, Stop! Bruh. Maybe uh, fence foundations will work to keep things from spawning. But I definitely... I bet I could kill this thing. Here we go. Nothing to it but to do it. Sorry, turtle. You're just an innocent bystander. Oh, did I get him? Oh, turtle got the finishing blow. Sweet. It's cool. I didn't want that XP anyways. But yeah, let me know. Will the fence foundation work to keep things from spawning? Hmm. I wonder. Fabricator. Gonna make us a fabricator. Whoa. Gonna put the fabricator on my bar. Gonna play the fabricator not over here. Oh man, do we what I don't have huh. <laughs> I don't have anywhere tall enough for it. No no no. It's gotta be somewhere this thing can go. Uh, I don't wanna place it sticking through the fracking ceiling. Ah, oh, dude. Lame sauce. I'm gonna have to move something. Um, you look really pretty right there, right? Maybe I need to move the preserving bin. I mean, that's going to be right in front of my windows. I don't know. I think you got to go preserving bin. Let me see. What, what you got in you? Blah, blah. Just some eggs. Ain't no big deal. Take that down. Oh, Lord. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get to my motel. And pistols. Bam! Bam! Eh, I guess it could look worse. Is it? Don't. No. Are you sticking through the house? Oh, thank goodness. I was about to have to tear it down. Oh, it is sticking through the... That's not that noticeable, right? Oh, I think I can live with that. Can I... <laughs> I don't really have a choice. I'm going to have to live with that for now. Crap! I'm definitely going to have to figure out somewhere else to put that. Dead gummit! T-Bunny, you built a stupid place for me. Don't even hold a fabricator. Aha! Five gasolines! Got some gas. Gonna make a bow. A compound bow. Put that in here. Um, weapons. Primitive range. Nine, oh, 95 fracking polymer. Uh, so, okay, and then, 
Let's see, polymer is, of course, it is obsidian and cementing paste, so it'll take two there. Uh, weapons, let's see. So that means I'm gonna need 200 cementing paste to make the polymer, plus the 75, I don't have that. Also, I don't think I have that much chitin. Oh man. Oh, lame sauce. Oh dude, I don't. Okay, well, it looks like Compound Bow's gonna have to wait for another episode, guys. We're just gonna run out of time on this one, but I'm developing a master plan within my mind right now to be able to get all the chitin and stuff we need. So, <laughs> okay, hold up, dear. This dadgum door, you're gonna let me walk into you and embarrass myself, and then when I back away, you're gonna open up. It's okay. I don't hold hard, I don't hold hard feelings. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Calico Theorem, you gonna spawn in here, bro? Ah, uh, level 8. Okay, well, whatever. Anyways, guys, I guess that's what we're going to call it for now. Next time, we'll have to go around, see if we can get the stuff to make the compound bow. I definitely want to try that out and have a secret plan to be able to get it. So make sure you tune in for that episode. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this, make sure to hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to see more episodes like this one. And until we meet again. Uh, yeah.